Transport phenomena in biosystem module 4 shell momentum balances segment 1 module overview with me Yusuf from bioengineering study program school of life sciences and technology institute technology bandung in this module we will demonstrate how to obtain the velocity profiles for laminar flows of fluids in simple flow systems which make use of the definition of viscosity the expressions for the molecular and convective momentum fluxes and the concept of a momentum balance. Once the velocity profiles have been obtained, we can get other quantities such as the maximum velocity, the average velocity or the shear stress at the surface. We will first discuss about how to set up differential momentum balances and then discuss several classical examples of viscous flow patterns. Although the problems that will be discussed are rather simple and involve idealized systems, they are nonetheless often used in solving practical problems. The systems studied in this module are arranged so that students are gradually introduced to a variety of factors that arise in the solution of viscous flow problems. Falling film problems illustrate the role of gravity forces and the use of Cartesian coordinates. It also shows how to solve the problem when viscosity may be a function of position. Flow in a circular tube problem illustrates the role of pressure and gravity forces and the use of cylindrical coordinates and a proximate extension to compressible flow is given. Flow in a cylindrical annulus problem emphasizes the role played by the boundary conditions, whereas flow of two adjacent immersible liquids discusses about the application of boundary conditions. Flow around a sphere problem illustrates how both tangential and normal forces are handled using spherical coordinates. This module is concerned only with laminar flow, which is the orderly flow that is observed, for example, in tube flow at velocities sufficiently low, that tiny particles injected into the tube move along a thin line, as shown in the right figure. This is in sharp contrast with the wily, chaotic, turbulent flow at sufficiently high velocities, that the particles are flung apart and dispersed throughout the entire cross-section of the tube. In this module, we will discuss about shell momentum balances, flow of a falling film, flow through a circular tube, flow through an annulus, flow of two adjacent immersible liquids, and a flow around a sphere. For the next segment, we will discuss about shell momentum balances. Until then, I am Yusuf from Institute Technology Bandung.